I created the animated videos on screen now in less than two minutes with Canva's AI video generator. And as animations usually cost thousands of dollars, it's crazy that you can start making these for free inside Canva. I can't believe that I'm just now realizing that Canva has this AI video generator. And it doesn't just make animations. I also made these realistic videos that you're seeing on screen now by just typing in a single text prompt. So in this video, we're going to test out Canva's AI video generator. And I'll also share some tips with you that I've learned on how to get the best videos possible from it. So here's the page inside Canva where we use the AI video generator. I'll share the link to this page in the description to this video. And this page is actually hidden inside Canva. I couldn't find any way of getting to it from inside the Canva website other than just using that link in the description. So no wonder that I've only just now discovered this. You have to have a Canva Pro account to be able to use the video generator. But I found a one month free trial to Canva Pro, which I've also linked to in the description to this video. So as long as you're on that Canva Pro free trial, and then you use the other link in the description to take you straight to this page, you'll be able to use the video generator and also use it for free for that first month. And we can see the AI video generator over here on the left hand side. Here is the prompt box where we type in the prompt into Canva, tallying it what we want in our AI generated videos. So I'll just quickly show you some examples that we can get up by clicking this inspire me box. Here's an example prompt that Canva's given us, a beautiful spring rose in a garden in the style of professional cinematography, natural light. We can press the inspire button again for another bit of inspiration, smoke billowing from the mouth of an active volcano. So you get the point, you type in what you wanna see in that box there. We can see down here that the Canva's AI video generator is powered by Runway, which is one of the leaders in text to video generation technology. And if we look down here, we can see that the generator uses a credit system. You get 50 credits a month with the AI video generator. You can see that I've got 22 credits left myself, which refresh on the 1st of December. That's because I've already generated and used 28 videos of those 50, leaving me with 22. So let's try out this prompt suggestion of smoke billowing from the mouth of an active volcano to show you what this Canva video generator can do. To do that, we just press this generate video down here. So we'll press that now. And Canva just now takes just a couple of minutes to generate that video for us from that single text prompt that we've entered. And now that's done, we can preview that to see how good of a job the AI video generator did. So to do that, we just simply hover over the video and that is looking pretty good to me. That's like realistic looking smoke. And once we've watched that back, we can choose whether we want to use that generated video or generate one again. And to generate one again, we can just scroll down here. We can change the prompt if we want. And I've got some tips from prompting that I'll show you in just a second. Or we can keep the prompt exactly the same and just press generate again. But I think that video at the top looks pretty solid. So let's just stick with this one for the time being. Now to use this, we just need to add it to our canvas. And for some reason, the canvas always loads in this vertical video aspect ratio. I don't know why, but to quickly fix that, I've learned you can just press this resize button up here, which only works if you're on Canva Pro. So make sure you're on Canva Pro. Resize it to a 1080p horizontal video aspect ratio by pressing this button. Just say you want to resize this design of your current canvas. Press resize again to change it from a vertical video to a horizontal video. There we go. Cool, that just took a second for the AI to do its thing and resize my canvas. I can now just delete everything that's on that canvas by selecting it and pressing delete. And then I can click this video I've generated over here. I just generated another one quickly. So I can just click that and there we go. It's added to our canvas. Just make it full size now. There we go. And if we press play, we'll see smoke coming from our active volcano. So I'm going to give you some prompting tips for this video generator in a second. And I'll do that while I'm making an animation style video like you saw at the start. But first, can we just acknowledge how incredible this is? Text to video technology in Canva in the hands of a tool that millions of video creators are using already. This is a huge opportunity for video creators. I just think that's really cool.
uh, let's jump into some prompting tips. So here's the prompt I typed in to create that cowboy animation you saw at the start of this video. A child's smiling cowboy figurine toy wearing a brown cowboy hat, yellow checked shirt and blue jeans inside a child's bedroom in the style of a 3D animation. So let's look through that to point out some prompting tips that I've learned to get the best possible videos. So first, it's important to point out that this prompt is split into three sections. You have section one here, where I tell the generator what I want. So I've asked it for the cowboy figurine toy first. The second section is here, where I've told the generator where I want that thing. So I specified I want it inside the child's bedroom. And finally, we have section three, where I've told the video generator the style of the video that I want generated. So here I've asked for it to be in the style of a 3D animation, but equally I could have also asked for it to be in an ultra realistic style if I wanted a traditional type of like movie video. So the thing you want in the video, where the thing should be, and then the style of the video, those are the three sections that you should be thinking about when you're writing out your prompts. Next, if we look at where I've asked it to generate that child's toy, I've been super specific here. I've said that the toy should be smiling, it should be a cowboy, it should be in the brown hat, yellow checkered shirt and blue jeans. Now it could have been easy to just type here that you want a child's toy, but I've learned that to get the video as close to what you have in your mind, you need to not avoid any details and provide as much specific detail around the thing you're asking for as possible in these prompts. So we'll generate this now and you'll see the benefit you get from just taking that extra effort when you're typing in your prompts. Let's generate that by pressing this button. And after just a couple of minutes, you'll see that we've been given this animated video on the left-hand side, which we can preview now to check it out. So let's do that. Just hover over it. And there we have a smiling cowboy. Look at that. And I'll just press this to add it to my canvas. And once that's in the canvas there, I can resize it if I want to. Press the share button up here and press this download button here and download my new animated video straight to my computer. Crazy stuff, how we can create Pixar quality animations in two minutes just with a single text prompt. AI generators are getting crazy. Video generators is just half of it. Image generators are equally nuts these days. I've made a video here actually about the best AI image generator I found for YouTubers in 2024. So seriously, watch that next. It's crazy what it can do for YouTube channels. Uh, and yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.